as a child, I was always running around in the store of my father and the stores of my mother. So originally the idea was that I was going to continue the stores of my parents, but then very quickly I thought like, no, creating fashion is much more fun than only buying and selling fashion. Going to fashion school was really like a discovery. It was also a very exciting time, so we talk about 1977. There was punk, there was Italian fashion, there was Claude Montana, Thierry Mugler, all these things. Plus also on fashion school, I met all those exciting people like Walter van Berendong, Dirk Bickenberg, and the Möllemeester. And immediately we were a very close bunch of friends, helping each other, pushing each other's creativity, and uh, challenging also each other's creativity. Just the idea that fashion could come from Belgium was so strange because Belgium was, I think, the most unfashionable country in the world. At least we thought so. So when we started to think about our own collections, we also thought like maybe we have to change our names. Maybe we have to ch change our names more in Italian or French. But we said, no, maybe if we're gonna try, we have to do it under our own name. 